For about a few weeks now, I've been creating a game about building spaceships and fighting other procedurally generated spaceships. And this is what it's currently at. So I'm going to start at the very beginning. This was the first prototype of the game. Everything's made out of simple shapes. The code is very messy. It still is, but we don't talk about that. After a few days of progress, it's looking a little better. The first thing you'll notice is I added better graphics and more game juice. It definitely looks better, and I added a shield which heals your units. Adding procedural enemies was hard, but I eventually got it working. It's still very unrealistic. Nothing really happened this week. All I added was a primitive build system. As you can see, this isn't very realistic, as you can place blocks anywhere you want. We are trying to make a realistic building simulator, so in the next few weeks I would add more realistic building. Another thing is that when you place a block, there is no way to destroy it. Even the enemies can't destroy it. It still looked pretty good, and it was a good template for the building system to come. And now we are finally at the part you guys all came here for. Creating a relatively decent building system. So I completely revamped the building system. It's now more realistic and has better connections. You can actually connect parts to the ship. The 3D models have been given a makeover because they didn't really fit the style I was going for. In this new building system, there are two types of thrusters that make your ship faster and more versatile, wing boosters and back boosters. There was still one big problem. Yeah, you can probably see the problem. The way I solved this was using a graph search algorithm to search everything from the center and what's not connected gets deleted. In game, this is what it looks like.
Let's see more of that. After I got this done, it was time to add procedurally generated enemies to the new building system. This proved to be challenging, but I got it done after a few days. It works by first manually generating a template out of cubes. It will then randomly generate things to put onto the ship. The result is something that looks kind of like a spaceship. Next thing up was to add pathfinding and have the enemies be able to follow the player. As you can see, it's working perfectly. I eventually got it working though. If you enjoyed the video, hit the subscribe button so you get notified when the next devlog comes out.